Welcome back to the next episode of Pokemon Uranium! We are here on the slopes of Mount Lanthanite, and before we get into our next fight, there's a little something to talk about. Now, if you lower your eyes down a little, you might see something special in my Pokedex collection. Yep, I did a grinding session yesterday, so let's see the rewards. First, I have an Ashelton. Ashelton's incredible eyesight allows them to see clearly up to three miles away. If you see red circles in a tree at night, is light reflected from there, so on and so on. It still hasn't fixed that. Why do I have an Ashelton? Well, I didn't raise my Alton. No, no, no. I found a shiny Ashelton. Yep, yep, yep. There it is. Anyway, let's move on to other catches and evolutions. Meet Dunsera. Said to be descended from a Dunsparce that climbed Sky Pillar. It is a powerful flyer and can alter the air pressure at will. The God Snake Pokemon! Oh my goodness, it's so good. Okay, there's some more Pokemon to read out yet still, so don't don't go anywhere. I just gotta remember who they are. Got something special to talk about Barriette in a bit. Something very special and exciting and important. You guys will love it. It's also nice seeing all... Is there a Gligar evolution in this game? Is there a Gligar? Yeah, there's a Gliscar. I remember the name Gliscar. Okay. I can't wait to see what the evolution of Sablu is. I bet it's great. It's good going through this and seeing all of these Pokemon. Huh. There's a Parodio evolution, maybe. Tikiki. Ah, here's my Hopterra. I did raise up Murum. It's a Hopterra, the Dragonfly Pokemon. A swift and fierce hunter, they can vibrate their wings at supersonic speeds in flight. They use their harpoon-shaped tails to skewer prey. Here's something cool. Hopterra has, uh, what is it called? Gale Wind? Gale Force? Where'd you say it? Gale Wings, which causes flying type moves to have priority. So it learned acrobatics and now it's a beast that murders everything. What else have we got? Oh, is Snowpatch the other fossil Pokemon? That's cool. Titanice, of course, exists on its own. Uh, my Fryni evolved into a Sidene. They are the bane of many fishermen, as their bladed tails often cut fishing lines. They can change direction rapidly in the water. Very good. Alright, what else have I got packed away in here? Let's keep going and look. All these evolutions, guys. They're exciting. Oh yes, I caught a Masking. It is capable of disguising itself as anything it likes. Although it appears to be a bird Pokemon, this is just an illusion. No one has seen its true form. And they appear in the labyrinth. Here's Dramsama, and when I was visiting the arcade recently, I saw they had a Dramsamaite on sale, so this thing has a Mega Evolution confirmed. Huh. Who's this guy? Not your Mega. Alright. What else do we have tucked away here, if anything? Uh, my Colava evolved into a Frosulo, but I've already caught one of those, so you know about that. Anyone else tucked away? There's the mini corn I have. It hasn't evolved yet. Say counter I learned recently was a legendary. I also learned the method to obtaining one, so we'll do that one day. Okay, finally, let's go to my bag and let's look at something very important. I was exploring the labyrinth and I found a path I hadn't gone down, and I found this: a Bariatite. You omen can mega evolve, you guys, and I'm super excited about that. Only the toughest can make it through the mountain. How tough. If you want to see me finding that barrier tight, I made it a highlight on my Twitch channel. Dermafrost. Oh god. So you can check out my Twitch. You'll find a link to it in the description of this video. And if you go there, you'll be able to find my highlights. And you can look for the video, Look What I Found. And you'll find me getting very excited. Get him, Kim. Nice. Wow, that was neutral too. Oh, that was all you had at huh, Logan? This was a worthy defeat. That's what the other two have said. Mercy of the Blizzard, thanks a lot. That is exactly what the You were the third person to use those lines. Go away. And go away, Frosulo. I mean, I have to get the evolution ring for Mega Stoning before we can Mega Evolve things. But when I do, we will Mega Evolve you, Omen. 
It's going to be a hard call between Mega Evolving Yomon or Spark. I'm going to have to decide based on how cool they are. I've already been told a little bit about Spark's Mega Evolution. I've seen it. I don't remember what it looks like. Like, I saw it and I just didn't internalize or study the picture. Hey, we're in Snowbank Town. Cool. Hey, I carved some wicked edge on the mountain today. Yeah? The slopes can't even handle me right now. Cool. Snowbank Town. A village wreathed in powdery snow. So, as we've learned, going forward through the path gets us to Snowbank. Climbing the mountain is its own thing. So we're going to be going back for that mountain soon. But first, we have to explore Snowbank. And hope that bird shuts up. <laughs> this town is always so quiet because of the falling snow. Take a moment to rest and watch the snowflakes drift down. That, that is actually really peaceful. Just the music and the snowflakes. It's really relaxing, honestly. Okay, time to move. What's going on in this thread? Nothing much. Just some rocks. You can skate around here, but that's all. Hi. Hey. My boss looks at Pokemon teeth all day. He even put his head in a Faf Ninter's mouth once. Faf Ninter? What is a Faf Ninter? Oh, I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. It's the evolution of a Fafur. I'll guarantee you. It's the same mountain. Same name thing. Okay. Store. Look at this ice settled on here. I love this town. My favorite holidays are... Whenever, whichever ones you get to eat a lot. Legit. Mama says I shouldn't buy more than I need. But I need 20 Poké Dolls! Hey, maybe you need to escape from 20 Pokémon. Um, I'm gonna buy some Max Repels. Give me 10 of those. If you're wondering about the obscene amount of money I have, I have been farming Theo. Do I need full heals? No, but I could do with some more Hyper Potions. No, not Max Potions, I don't need those. But I'll take three more Hyper Potions. You know, farming Theo has been pretty good. Like, I could have done that perpetually and made enough money to just buy everything from the arcade. But I didn't. Urgh, you've reached chilly Snowbank Town. You best bundle up. It gets even colder at night. I really like Ice Latin Towns. Uh, Bruma? Bruma, I think. From Oblivion. I loved a lot. Hey, dude. Uh, you there. You're a trainer, aren't you? I Meaning you'll be challenging the gym? Perhaps you'll be wanting some advice. Yes, please. To challenge the Snowbank Gym, you have to pass a series of trials. These are meant to test your strength as a trainer and your wisdom to make the right choice when it counts. Your ability to adapt to different conditions, your Pokemon's faith in you, and your faith in your Pokemon, and your strength to discern truth from lies. If you fail any one of the tests, you'll have to start from square one again. Boy, let me tell you, it ain't easy to get up when you're knocked down. But keep on trying. That's what it takes to win. Because only when you pass the trials and defeat the leader Varen can you unlock the true power in your Pokemon. The power of Mega Evolution. Oh, how would an old man like me know about all about this? Well, to tell the truth, I used to be an acolyte of the dragon myself. Now the winter cold in the mountain causes these old bones to ache and a stiff breeze could snap me in half. So I stay here by the fire, giving advice to trainers. As thanks for listening, I want you to have this. <sighs> drill Garnite! Okay, I don't have a Drill Garn, but yeah, what's that rock you ask? Well, you can't use it now, but once you conquer the trials, You'll be able to use it to trigger Mega Evolution and a Pokemon. Good luck. You'll need it. Damn. So, confirmed. Pluck. Ah, uh, when we beat this gym, we get Mega Evolution, guys. Maybe we should prioritize the gym over the mountain. Do you know the Pokemon Alpico? If you've got one, want to trade it for my Anderind? Do I have an Alpico? Not yet. I have to evolve my Puffluff to one. But, uh, keep that in mind. And it sounds like, given that guy said he was an Acolyte of the Dragon, this gym is actually dragon-themed. 
So maybe Dun Seraph is actually going to do the work. I love Puff Luff. It's so Puff Luffy. Adorable. Oh, your Pokemon looks so cute. Here, give them some of these. Oh. I just love seeing Pokemon that are happy with their trainers. You take good care of them now. My wife is very generous to passing trainers with how difficult the gym is. They need all the help they can get. When you said some, how many did you mean? Because I will put some into my team. Right now. Three. Alright, um, Simone? Trying to learn S Slash, there it is! Okay. Uh, 75.95, which isn't as good as Skyfall, but the flinching combined with Serene Grace is really good. I like Coil a lot. Wait, Coil boosts accuracy. I could Coil into the Skyfall Air Slash lock over the entire gym if Lemons can survive. Not lemons, uh, Simon. Chat's talking about lemons again. I might drop Yawn. That's a scary combo. Simon's getting buff. Okay, one more for Simon. And one for Bomberman. Yep, that's fine. What a nice family. I know Yawn has utility, but you gotta choose, pick and choose. I'm so cold. Say, do you have a Pokemon that knows the move Overheat? That would definitely warm this place up. Just give me a moment, actually. I can always get Yawn back. It's a TM. Is it? Maybe it's not. Whatever. I can go. just go to the uh, move learner to get it back. Yes. Honestly, I can just trade out Toxic and then take it back. Hey, girl. I have overheat now. I'm gonna burn your house down. Can I could be used overheat? Ah, uh, Cam. That's much better. Here, take this as thanks. Obtained a Dawnstone. Huh. What's a Dawnstone? Guys, do you know what a Dawnstone is? That doesn't sound familiar to me. Is that a Uranium Unique Stone? Alright. Pokemon Center. Yeesh, that gym kicked my butt. As if freezing winds weren't enough. The trainers are brutally tough. If we hear avalanche warning sirens, make sure to get the, to a safe place. I hear there's five trials you have to beat at the gym. But I can't get past the first one! Alright, Dawnstone is unique to this game then. No, it's a feature of the series. Okay, never mind. I don't recognize it at all. Then again, I really dropped out after third gen. Like, I did not play through fourth gen and fifth gen I didn't do much with. It wasn't until sixth gen I got back into Pokemon. Most of my team aren't really good against dragons, actually. Maybe I should teach Spark Ice Beam. I'm going to move Yoma up because I'd really like Yoma to start getting some levels. I mean, move some, why am I mixing up everyone's names today? Hey, dude. Yo, dude, these runs are mad gnarly. Toad's granular, bra. Phew, how did you beat me here? Taurus, you here to challenge the gym too? I guess I made it here first. <laughs> Surprised I look different? I got some new clothes in Silverport. That t-shirt wasn't working in the cold weather. Plus, now I look much more badass. Uh, anyway, I hear this gym is supposed to be really tough. Apparently there's trials you gotta face, but if you beat them, you get the power of Mega Evolution? Cool, huh? 
Though, apparently the gym leader's no pushover either. Ah, you two. You want to challenge the gym, no? Very good. This gym challenge is customarily undertaken in pairs. Did you hear that? We get to tackle this gym together! Me and Taurus! Ah, uh, you'll miss some stuff, Jenkins. Uh, well, not exactly. You'll be split up for the trials, but reunite in time to take on the leader. Sounds good to me! What do you say, Taurus? Ready to take on the gym? Yes! Okay, we're ready! Let's go! Follow me. In order to challenge gym leader Veyron, you'll need to complete five trials. Once you begin these trials, you must complete them all without stopping. If you choose to leave or you fail a trial, you must begin the test over from the beginning. I should also add, you will need a Pokemon that knows strength for the first trial. If these terms are agreeable to you, we will begin with the first trial. Taurus, your door is on the left. Theo, take the exit to the right. Let's do this! <laughs> oh, just didn't let me go through there. Alright. Take the entrance to the left to do your first trial. Radio. Alright, let's uh, get started. This is your first trial, the trial of strength. Show that you have the power to bend the world to your will. Alright? Hmm. Can't really tell what's the correct answer in this ah. environment. I'm gonna try this one. Did that immediately screw me? Wow, they're not messing around in this. Yes, please reset the room. Man, they just left me guessing that one. Alright, this one goes up. Alright, strength puzzle. That's okay. I don't hate it. There we go. Very good. You've surpassed the first part of the trial. Now, see if you can overcome my might in battle! Alright. Alright, Acolyte Trofgar. Send out your Baran. Oh, it's level 48. That's gonna be bad for Simon. Okay, Simon, this is this is really important. You need to start winning. Buddy, you really need to start winning. There you go. That's what you need to be doing, Simon. We need to get you leveled immediately. You need to pretty much be the only one winning. That's Ice Dragon. If it uses an ice move, Simon's friggin' dead. I'm gonna let Bomberman get in here and Iron Head. But Simon needs to be winning as much as possible here, because it's extraordinarily important. Because Simon needs to have all the levels. All of them. Get him, Bomberman. Iron Head. Hey, there's my boy! There's my boy! Turland. Yep, okay, that is back to Bomberman. Let's back to Simon. Wow, I am just mixing up names today. I'm not on top of these names. I have no idea why, I'm just not. Oh, I'm so excited for Mega Evolution. Dragon Breath! Oh, that's priority. That's really bad for Simon. Oh, level 50, that's uh... Come on, Simon! I believe in you! Oof. Simon! Okay, I think that Dragon Rush wasn't priority, so... Hey! Good going, Simon. I, li I like Mercy. It gives me the classics. You've shown your strength. Well done. You've passed the trial of strength. Go onwards. Hey, Theo. Man, that guy was tough, but I beat him! I guess you did too, Taras. The next trial is the trial of wisdom. Theo, go through the door at the right. Taras, go through the one on the left. Alright, let's uh, heal someone up. Do I have a move that reduces super effective dragon type moves? 
I guess I've got like a berry that reduces special stuff or something. I don't know, it's not really helping as much as I need it to. Just get a Hyper Potion onto Simon. And pray Simon can keep on winning. This trial will test your wisdom. A good trainer must know how to use their mind to overcome the problems in their path. Alright. Alright, backwards calculation. Never mind, it's already over. Guy, come on now. Very well, I see you've used your mind to think critically and navigate this room. And prove your wisdom by successfully countering my strategies. Uh, providing your similar strength to the last guy, Vanscore, you are just going. To okay, that is Ice Bug. Bug! Bug, bug, bug! Come on, come on, come on! Skyfall! Mad. Simon's one of the mad lads. Get that XP. Oh, yes. About to send in Coatleth. That's Grass Dragon. Get that Skyfall. Ooh, Dragon Pulse. That could be extraordinarily bad for Simon. Yeah. Couldn't do that one, huh, buddy? I think I'm going to get you a quick claw. Uh, Chemical B. And Sludge Bomb. Oh, you're a tanky boy, aren't you? It's okay, Simon will be back in just a moment. I have revives. Unfortunately, not going to get the XP I really need him to off of this fight. About to send Voltasu. I have no idea what that is, but I'm going to try and kill it with Bomberman. Just so Bomberman can get some levels. A vulture. I have no idea what this is or what its etymology is, but I'd like to rock slide it. Yeah, Kenby is a badass. Oh. Oh, you're a flying type, aren't you? I think I can kill it with a beat up. Yeah. Two. Three. Four. Five. You got this, Yarman. Defeated Acolyte Vanscore. Well done. Oh, their robes have the pattern of Mega Evolution on them. Dark flying would be my guess. But the vault is weird. Man, that one was a real brain bender, but my strategies were better in the end. The next trial is the trial of adaptability. Theo, go through the door at the right, and Taurus, go through the one on the left. So here's an important question. If I were to leave, will the fights reset? Because could I farm these guys with Simon? Uh, do I have a quick more spare right now? Yeah. Alright, someone get that on you. Drop the lucky egg, get the quick claw. I need you to have that chance of going first. This trial will test your ability to adapt to rapid change. For a good trainer, the elements should pose no threat on the way to perfection. Mm. 
Oh, there he goes. I like sliding puzzles. This is fine. I like the changing sounds as you go along too. That's nice. Alright, not an issue. Sutton, bro. We've shown that the forces of Mother Nature are not enough to stop you. Defeat me to prove that this adaptability extends to your battle style too. Well, as long as you give me something that Simon can beat up, Acolyte's Eye, that would be great. Oh. Well, that level gap isn't about to do me any favors. But Simon goes first. Come on, Simon. I believe in you. Wow, that did not do nearly enough. Uh, man, I would have to crit this or paralyze. If it had paralyzed, I would have been in there, but... Simone, I'm going to trade you out so you can get this XP. Uh, you're using air moves. I'm going to let Spark take this. Air moves. Flying types. Do you reckon hail counts as a storm? I'm asking for a friend. Yeah, Spark picked up Thunder in the grind. I was a little sad replacing Scold, but you gotta have Thunder, man. Wow, that did not do much. Whatever, the next Thunderbolt will do it. This Dunserif Dun Serif will go down, and... Simon will gain a level. Given the random trainers using level 50s, I'm starting to get really worried about this gym leader though. Like, genuinely concerned. Because they could be a super badass. About to send in a Tracton. <sighs> That's Yeoman's job. That's definitively Yeoman's job. No one else is made here. Wait, is Tracton Steel Dragon? That would blow my mind. Maybe it is Steel Dragon! Holy crap. It also hurts quite a lot. Luckily, Yeoman comes in here with the stop. Collaborate. And that Moxie. Just in case Yoma needs to smack down whatever's next. And next is a Dlavanug. I don't recognize that, but it sounds like ice, so I'm just gonna let Yoma punch it. It's ice water. And anyway, Yoma will now punch it. And my problems will go away. So this gym uses a mix of ice and dragon types, and that's horrific. I just want to put that on the field where everyone can see it. That is horrifying. Trying to learn foul play. What's foul play, you know? Oh! It's a 9500 dark move with 100 accuracy! Sweet! Goodbye beat up! Well done. Cool. We've surpassed the trial of adaptability. Follow me, and I will lead you to your next trial. Phew, thought like my legs were gonna fall out from under me. But I made it through alright, I think. Looks like you did it without any trouble at all, Taurus. This next trial is the trial of faith. Theo, go through the door at the right, and Taurus, go through the one on the left. Yep. 
All right, Trial of Faith, let's do that on the next episode. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.